Today was the final day of this first phase of the case against Meng Wanzhou, the uh, Huawei C uh, chief financial officer charged with fraud or facing extradition to the United States on fraud charges. Today, the defense was their final submission. They repudiated, it. They, they repudiated that. They argued that no, this case is still really about fraud. Uh, in this closing summation, the defense lawyer, Richard Peck, said this is a unique case. It's unique because it's dealing with a law that, Canadian, that Canada has repudiated. He said it's unique because we're dealing with sanctions that aren't normally dealt with in extradition law. This is a different case in that way. And he said at the end of the day, right needs to be done. Right is part of any under law. Right is part of the Canadian system, and it's only right that she should not be sent back to, sent to the United States to face these charges. Well, there is another court hearing set in June. The feeling is the decision would be out before that date. So it could be a couple months, several months before we see. It would probably be a written decision. The hearing in June would deal with the issue that when uh, Meng Wanzhou was arrested at the Vancouver airport, her, her rights were violated, that was an improper arrest, that procedures were done incorrectly. And they're arguing then the case should be thrown out because of her arrest in the first place. Uh, it's a bigger battle of, the, of China's will and the U.S.'s will over technology, 5G phone networks come in. So this case is being played out before the, before the background of a lot of international intrigue and political interest.